Hi everyone, this is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. If you are looking for a lip sync AI model, then maybe your search is over. Byte Dance, which is a company behind TikTok, has just released Latent Sync, which you can use to do lip syncing in some of the videos. In this video, we are going to install it locally and we will see how it works. Let me first give you a small quick demo from their GitHub repo and then we will see how it works, how we can get it installed and all of the rest of the information. So let me take you to my browser. So if you see here on the left hand side is the original video and on the right hand side is the uh, lip synced video in another language. So let me first play the original one. Всем привет! Я снова рада вас видеть на своем канале, и мне безумно нравится то, что мы ведем этот прекрасный влог о моей жизни. Один. Okay, and now let me play the lip synced one. Are you a broke beauty like me that loves to gamble but doesn't have this money? Then you have to download Cash Bash. This slot game has a super high payout. You see. How good is that? Really, really good. So in order to do this lip syncing, all you need to do is to provide the video and then the audio which you want to do the layover. So which you want to lip sync, of course, and then it creates another video with the lip synced audio. Now, this is what we are going to install it locally and then we will see how it works. They also have shared some of the training code. If you want to fine tune your own model, your own uh, tool that would be good too and by the way it is open source it is state of the art and it uses diffusion models behind the scene but let me take you back to some of the technical details in order to understand this model bit better so what is happening here is that it is showing you latent sync which is an end-to-end -end lip sync framework based on audio conditioned related diffusion models without any intermediate motion representation. So this primarily diverges from previous diffusion based lip sync methods based on pixel space. And because it it is based in the latent space, so it makes it faster and more performant. And if you don't know what is meant by latent space, just go to my channel, search with latent space and you should be able to find a very easy to understand video. So this framework or model can use the powerful capabilities of stable diffusion to directly model complex audio visual correlations. They have also found out that the diffusion based lip sync methods show inferior temporal consistency. And that is why they have proposed something called as trapper or temporal representation alignment to enhance temporal consistency while preserving lip sync accuracy. And there's a lot of the technical detail as you can see in the screen. Latent sync is using the whisper to convert MEL spectrogram into audio embeddings, which are then integrated into the unit via cross attention layers. And then the reference and mask frames are channel wise concatenated with noised latents as the input of a unit. And they have shared also a paper which you can read through if you are interested in more in-depth technical details of this model. But I'm not going to bore you with further technical details. So let's try to get it installed locally. Before that, let me give a huge thanks to Mast Compute who are sponsoring the VM and GPU for this video. If you are looking to rent a GPU on a very, very affordable prices, I will drop the link to their website in video's description and I'm also going to give you a coupon code of 50% discount on range of GPU so do check them out. This is my Ubuntu system and this is my GPU card NVIDIA RTX 6000 with 48 GPU of VRAM and by the way you would need around 6 to 7 gig of VRAM in order to perform this lip syncing on small uh, videos which I just showed you. Okay so first up Let's git clone the repo of latent sync and I will drop the link to it in video's description. That is done. We need to now uh, install and create all the environment. So what they have done is they have shared this setup environment script, which is a simple bash script that uh, creates a conda environment and then it installs all the prerequisites. So I'm just going to run it. It is going to take four to five minutes depending upon your specs. So let's wait for it to install everything.
and now it is downloading all the models which are required after installing the prerequisites so this is a good thing about this script that first it creates a conda environment that installs all the prerequisites and then downloads all the required models okay so everything is installed now we can do the inference so let me clear the screen the good thing is that they have even provided a script for inference which primarily picks up a video and audio from the local directory and then outputs a um, lip synced video so let me run it and it is loading the checkpoints and now it is generating that lip synced video it seems let me also quickly check how much is the vram consumption in real time so just consuming over 4 gig of vram which is quite cool and it might increase to 6 gig of vram 6 to 7 gig anyway let's wait for it and then it is doing the sample inference let's check the vram consumption again you see it has gone over 6 gig of vram that's the max it is going to use it is still working on that and while that happens what is it is doing it is picking up this demo one audio and demo one video from the local assets directory from the root of the repo let me quickly play both of these for you so i'm just going to play the video for you it's the same one which we saw earlier now we're rather was seeing it in the same channel and me безумно нравится то что мы ведем этот прекрасный влог о моей жизни один okay and then let me play the audio are you a broke beauty like me that loves to gamble but doesn't have this money? Then you have to download Cash Bash. This slot game has a super high payout. So you see, one thing you need to make sure that you see the audio is 9 seconds and the video is 10 seconds. So audio and video should be of similar length, make sure. And that goes without saying, of course. And let's see, Go. let's go back there and see what it is, what it generates. So let me take you back and that has completed as i just moved there so let's check it out in the output and the output primarily goes here in the root of the repo with the name of video underscore out and you can even open this inference.sh and check that out and you can change that path anyway so let me uh, open it in my browser quickly and show you how that looks like this is the resultant one are you a broke beauty like me that loves to gamble but doesn't have this money? Then you have to download Cash Bash. This slot game has a super high payout. Really good stuff. Now that was good, but let's try it out with one of our own um, files. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to provide it my own audio file and see how it works. And I will keep it raw. I'm not going to sugarcoat this. So let's try it out. I'm going to first open this code in the VS code and we will change the path so this is a code in VS code let's click on inference.sh this is a script and this is a video out file so I'm just going to call it maybe video out file and then instead of this I already maybe I will copy my one of audio file and from my local system to this so I'm going to home I already have an audio file which I will also play it for you um, this is a math mp3 let's go back and then latent sync assets i'm just going to paste it here okay i'm not sure if mp3 works i'll just try it out the other audio files are in wave format but mp3 should work too anyway so i'm just going to open it and then for audio path i'm just going to call it math.mp3 if this doesn't work i'm going to change it into wave format so i'll just say math.mp3 and then i will keep the video as is i have saved it let me play that audio file for you it's the same video file by the way solve this math equation x plus y is equal to x minus y now this is around 8 seconds so that which is not far the other audio was 9 seconds and this is the same video which I am going to use so I am going to lip sync it so with this person 
with this my voice so let's see how that works it should be weird if it works anyway so i'm just going to take you back here and then i'm going to open my terminal let me clear the screen and then we are just going to run this inference again let's see what it does this time so it has detected my audio file the video file remains the same loaded the model and then it is going to process it so i will just wait for it to finish processing and now it is sampling the frames that is going to take a minute or two okay so it has finished lip syncing my video uh, with audio so if i go to this local repo you see there is this video out path file let me take you to my browser and i will play it for you let's play it solve this math equation x plus y is equal to x minus y that was actually quite cool and you see that it has uh, trimmed the video to eight seconds which is the length of my audio very happy about this really really good stuff okay so now in the next test what i'm going to do i'm going to give it my own video and then another uh, voice so let me see uh, how it goes but first let me play my video hello guys welcome to the channel this is just a sample video for deep life cam i hope that you're enjoying the content on the channel and learning it uh, please also share whatever you learn because it is uh, a combined journey of learning and if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel thank you very much okay and let me play the audio it's a different audio within the house they go themselves to and fro about the city and beat themselves with their garments bound up by a girdle so i want to lip sync this audio on top of this video let me now take you back to my vs code and then this is where i already have specified the path this is my new video a new audio and then I am just outputting it in the local um, current directory with a new name. Let me go here. Let's clear it and then let me run it. Let's see how it goes. It is going to load the audio and video. They are both loaded, loading the checkpoints. And then it is going to start processing it and sampling it. Let's wait for it to finish and then we will see how it goes. So it has produced the output as if you go to the root of the repo, you will see that there is a new file here. Let me play this in my browser and then we will see what exactly it has produced. So just to uh, refresh your memory, this is the original video. Hello guys, welcome to the channel. This and then this is the audio in the female voice. Then leaving the corpse within the house. And this is the resultant video. Let's see. Then, leaving the corpse within the house, they go themselves to and fro about the city and beat themselves with their garments bound up by a girdle. Not bad. Not bad at all. Of course, it's not perfect, but really, I think very, very close. So lip syncing is quite good. Again, have a look at the lips. Then, leaving the corpse within the house, they go themselves to and fro about the city and beat themselves with their garments bound up by a girdle. So look, really good stuff. Very impressed by this. Really, really, uh, I think one of the good models in a long time when it comes to lip syncing with AI. Try it out. Let me know what you think. I will put all the code in my blog and I will drop the link in video description so that you can also uh, play around with it. The VRAM consumption is also very low, so have fun. But also do me a favor too. If you like it, please consider subscribing to the channel. If you're already subscribed, please, please do me a favor and share it among your network as that is the only marketing I do. So I would be very, very obliged. Thank you very much.